Good morning, everybody. And what better way than start off always in the garden? I'm going to be sharing a principle that I discovered as I was working in the garden yesterday. So here, here's my peach tree. This is a volunteer peach tree. And if you notice, it's kind of gotten out of control. And, but I've been taking care of it, so it's growing beautifully. But then notice this, notice what's going on here. The leaves are falling off. The leaves are falling off. And I, I couldn't believe it. I'm like, well, I'm doing everything I'm supposed to be doing. I'm doing everything that is to cause this tree to, to thrive and to bloom. And so I was talking to another fellow gardener and he said, it's too much. There's too much growth there. <laughs> and I thought, ding, 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 ding. Just learned a principle there. Sometimes we do, we start pursuing our dreams, we start pursuing our goals, we start pursuing life, and we kind of just focus just on that and nothing else. And just like that peach tree starts to kind of die because we don't have the setup of the instrument. We don't have the infrastructure set up to handle it. And I thought, wow, what a valuable lesson. We always hear, you know, pursue your dreams, go for it, nurture. But what I realize is everything requires balance. Everything requires balance. So now I want to go show you my other tree that I've just planted. And look at look at it. Same thing. I'm taking care of it, doing what I'm supposed to do for it. And look at it. It's thriving. Even though there's been some pests that have come in and started chomping a little bit it's still thriving it's doing very well and I've got another tree over here it's doing very well but what I've done is I've pruned it I've pruned it so that it can handle what growth it takes on to where that one in the front I thought I had pruned it enough but it didn't it couldn't handle it didn't have the infrastructure to support all that all those new leaves and limbs and everything and I need to be able to see the trunk and you can't all that growth happened this year it was amazing how much growth has come on just this year and so that principle that yes you pursue your dreams yes you go after your goals yes you you do what you can but you also have to have balance. You have to have balance as you pursue those dreams because if you don't, it's going to throw other things out of whack. Just like that peach tree there, other things have gotten out of whack. It cannot support it and so it's starting to drop its leaves to support what growth it has. Well, your leaves could be family, could be friends, could be your own sanity, not taking care of yourself, not nurturing and nourishing yourself, not doing some self-care. These things are so vital. Sometimes we pursue our dreams, our goals to the point where we start to neglect our children, not intentionally, and we guise it in the form of, I'm doing it for you, so we can have this, so we can do that. We have to have balance. And it's through balance that we actually find the greatest joy and happiness that life can offer. If we don't have balance, that's when frustration starts happening, anger, resentment. And you're gonna find life kinda is 
it's more it's not really truly balanced and at least in my opinion and in what I've experienced in my life it's more like a oblong wheel that it kind of goes it doesn't spin perfectly because life is not perfect every time you think that things are starting to spin perfectly <laughs> guarantee something's gonna throw you off balance and it's we want to be a little off balance so that we continue to grow, we continue to push ourselves, we continue to be better than we are currently. Because if we're not, and we are that perfect will, oh yeah, it's nice, it's just coasting now and it's sitting back and relaxing and going, oh yeah, everything's grand. But then we're not growing. So we've gotta have balance as we pursue our dreams and our goals, gotta have balance with our family, with relationships. We have to have balance with our health, extremely important. Your health goes out, everything goes out because you can't take care of it, things. It does no good if you have all this money and you've pursued your dream and you've made millions of dollars or billions of dollars if you can't do anything with it because you are not well. And that's the valuable lesson that I learned from my peach tree. It's gone out of balance. I've got to put it back into balance. We're gonna end here really quick, but I'm gonna show you. And then this is another tree. Notice you can see the trunk, but notice this one is doing very well. It's not dying up top, it's not losing its leaves. It's doing very well. And that's because I did prune it. I took care of it by balancing it, giving it the supportive infrastructure that it needs. So you know right now where you're at in life, where something may just kind of seem off. Something may just be chaotic maybe and you're out of balance could be pursuing your dreams or may not be pursuing your dream but whatever it is start to identify what it is and what it's going to take to put it back into balance to put it back into its proper role as you do that you're going to discover greater joy and happiness and a love of life. Look at what's going on in your life right now. Identify the areas of, that you need balance in and then go get that balance. Whatever that may be. And a lot of people, it's self-care. A lot of people, they need to do things for themselves. Go recharge and recover, especially after accomplishing a goal. You're amazing. Believe it. Have a fantastic day.